Hi, I'm Evan, and I'm a learning portfolio manager here at Google. And I have one of the coolest jobs in the world, where I get to look at all the different technologies that affect big data, and then work them into training courses like this one for students to take. I wish I had a course like this when I was first coming out of college or high school. It was honestly a data analyst course that's geared in the way like this one is, if you've already taken some of the videos, really prepares you to do anything you want. It'll open all of those doors that you want, for any of those roles inside of the data curriculum. Well, what are some of those roles? There are so many different career paths for someone who's interested in data. Generally, if you're like me, you'll come in through the door as a data analyst, and you'll be working with spreadsheets, you'll be working with small, medium, and large databases, but all you have to remember is three different core roles. Now, there's many in special, well, there's specialties within each of these different careers, but these three are the data analyst, which is generally someone who works with SQL, spreadsheets, databases, might work as a business intelligence team creating those dashboards. Now, where does all that data come from? Generally, a data analyst will work with a data engineer to turn that raw data into actionable pipelines. So you have data analysts, data engineers, and then lastly, you might have data scientists who basically say, the data engineers have built these beautiful pipelines. Sometimes the analysts do that too. The analysts have provided us clean and actionable data and the data scientists then work to actually turn it into really cool machine learning models or statistical inferences that are just well beyond anything you could have ever imagined. And we'll share a lot of resources and links for ways that you can get excited for each of these different roles. And the best part is, if you're like me, when I went into school, I didn't know what I wanted to do. And you don't have to know at the outset which path you wanna go down. Try them all, see what you really, really like. It's very personal. Becoming a data analyst is so exciting. Why? Because it's, it's not just like a means to an end. It's just, it's taking on a career path where so many bright people have gone before and have made the tools and technologies that much easier for you and me today. For example, when I was starting to learn SQL or the structured query language that you're gonna be learning as part of this course, I was doing it on my local laptop and each of the queries would take like 20, 30 minutes to run. And it was very hard for me to keep track of the different SQL statements that I was writing or share them with somebody else. That was about 10 or 15 years ago. Now, through all the different companies and all the different tools that are making data analysis tools and technologies easier for you, you're gonna have a blast creating these insights with a lot less of the overhead that I had when I first started out. So I'm really excited to hear what you think and what your experience is going to be.